and good morning welcome into my channel this is the truck or Rudy show we are still in Madison Head but we did just pick up our trailer and we are ready to head back home we got ourselves a reload out of the same place that we uh, delivered to and I don't know if you won't be able to see it but it says good year on there yeah that's where I delivered to and that's where I picked up my reload so here we go we are making our way to uh, our hometown Steinbach so we'll get going here and now we'll see you down the road just figured I would show you guys the prairies up here this is Saskatchewan we just entered Saskatchewan here a little bit ago and as you can probably see there is absolutely no trees around absolutely none you got a little bit of bushes like this here the odd time but that's about the best you're gonna get up here in Saskatchewan and there ain't that much snow out here either it's been a very very warm winter so far I don't know usually in January we got very cold temperatures and we got very good temperatures right now Matter of fact, it's supposed to go above zero today, which is above 32 Fahrenheit. That's uh, not not unheard of, but uh, it's very rare that it will get that warm in January. I think the normal temperature is like minus 20 Celsius. Uh, that's that's about the normal temperature we got plus. So that's uh, that's amazing. Yeah, well, we are putting the hammer down going home today. We won't make it home today, but uh, we shall be home tomorrow. Uh, I could make it home today if I had the hours. But since I've uh, had so many miles already under my belt this week, uh, I am low on hours. So I can only uh, drive about nine and a half hours today because uh, I had nine and three quarter hours uh, left today. So we need 15 minutes to do our pre-trip. and. And then I have nine and a half hours that I can drive, so we'll see where that's going to put us tonight. Yeah, I should be close to the Manitoba border somewhere, but at least we'll get some miles in, and we shall be home tomorrow, uh, tomorrow morning sometime, I think. And then we will have the weekend off. Yay! I'll probably even take Monday off. I booked, uh, I booked a truck into uh, into the shop on Monday. Is I want to get uh, get it checked out to see where my noise is coming from. As you guys probably know, I told you guys all week already that I thought I had problems with my turbo, but we'll see what it actually ends up being, or if we can find it, and then I'll tell you guys what it was. We just had a little bit of a pit stop up here in the Swift Current, Saskatchewan. North service roadies. And right here on the left is Boston Pizza. And I went and grabbed me a bite to eat in there. I was pretty hungry already and hadn't had anything to eat today, so we needed to eat. That's pretty good pizza in there, that's for sure. Yeah. We got ourselves some nice sunshine too. Yeah, I already looked it up and it looks like I should be able to get her into Manitoba. I was looking at it and it looks like uh, I could possibly even make it to Brandon. I might get a little later tonight by the time I get there, but we'll see. We'll see what will happen at the end of the day. And now we shall be home tomorrow. In 400 meters, turn right on. Yeah, it's Avenue, a little bit of a service four, road right here. Turn left in two hundred. You gotta go meters. on to to get to these businesses, but yeah, they are low parking there on the side street, so that's good. Now we can go and have a bite to eat or whatever we need to do, you know. We are just entering Moose Jaw right now. In one kilometer, turn and right on I have two. decided to go. Stop over here at the Flying J and go take me a shower. I feel like having a shower right now, so 
gonna go have a shower and then we'll continue on with our journey not a very big well it's sort of like a uh, shell slash flying J type of truck stop here so technically it is, it is a flying J but it's also a shell <clears throat> but we'll go uh, go in here and have ourselves a shower and then we'll get back on the road well here we go they got the washer and dryer down here you know and they said shower four so here we go we got the ticket we got a pin number we got to enter that over here so we're gonna do that all right oh there we go that door opens here we are that's me that ugly face yep i'm gonna show you this it's not a bad shower down here you know it's a pretty good size just figure I show most of you guys probably never seen a trucker what they gotta go through, how they take showers and all that, you know? Well, I'm not gonna show you exactly how we take a shower, but this is what the showers look like down here, so we'll be back. Well, here we go. We finished having a shower, and now we're gonna put the hammer down and try and get as far tonight as we can. Alrighty, here we are. We have made it to Verd in Manitoba. We got uh, 360 kilometers left to go to go home. We will do that tomorrow morning. I am just done for today. I am tired. And we will be spending a night over here. We've uh, been kind of lazy today, but yeah, what can you do if you don't have a whole lot of hours, right? But anyways, I'm gonna make this short and sweet, I hope. And with that, we will see you again tomorrow at 5 a.m.